Hello everybody, my name is Darkness, and welcome back to another cliffhanger. As promised, I told you I'd be making the video on Tuesday, and here I am. Today's story is not going to be very long. I have a lot of stuff to do, and my daughter is in the pool with my, uh, my wife. So I'm going to make this video a short video, so I can go enjoy some family time. But I also made a promise to you guys to my 314 subscribers that I would be making a cliffhanger video today. So, if you guys are ready, today's story is called The Mirror. It's by Bree Williams. It is only one chapter, but here soon. I will be doing some of the longer ones. There are three, four, five, even six chapters of stories of cliffhanger. And I will be doing that. But if you guys are ready, let's begin. Something weird is happening in my mirror. What do you mean? If I turn off the lights, it's almost like something is moving in there. Something behind me. But, when I turn my on my light, there's nothing there. I'm sure it's just weird things with the shadows. Maybe. Turn off the lights again and see. No way. I'm never turning off the lights again. Come on. Then you realize it's nothing. And you won't be freaked out anymore. You think? Definitely. Okay. I hope you're right. Tessa. Did you do it? Yes. For a second. Well, it's hard to explain, but when I turned off the lights, my face wasn't there at all, and it seemed like there was another face there instead, staring out. What kind of face? Look like a man. Well, what did he look like? I, I couldn't really tell. I turned the lights on and it disappeared. Turn the back off and see what happens again. No, I can't. It went away when you turned on the light, right? Yeah. So, you can always just turn it back on if you get too scared. That's true. You really think it's safe? I think so. I think... It must be happening for a reason. We should try and find out what it is. Okay, I'll do it. But I'm gonna keep my fingers on the light switch. Okay, here goes. Lights off. See anything? Yes. He's there. Don't turn on the light yet. What does he look like? He has dark hair and a beard. He looks kind of crazy. 
like a criminal or something. The image is getting clearer all the time. Is he doing anything? Just staring. What if he can see me too? I'm gonna turn on the light. No, not yet. Try and talk to him. Tessa, you still there? Okay, I just said hello. And? He didn't say anything. But he's looking right at me now. There's something shiny in his hand. I think it's a knife. You think? I just turned on the light. Is he gone? Yes. Just an empty mirror. You really saw a knife? I think so. It looked big too. Like a butcher's knife. It was inside his jacket. He can't hurt you. Whatever it is, it's stuck in the mirror. I think you should turn the light off again. I don't know. Please, Tessa. This is the most interesting thing that'll ever happen. I'll give you ten dollars if you turn off the lights. Oh my god, you're crazy. I think you're right. I almost have to now. Okay. Lights off. Well, wow, the image is even clearer now. He's still there, and he's still showing me the knife, same as before. Now I can see behind him. It's dark, but it looks like he's outside. What do you mean? Like, outdoors? Yeah, and I think it's snowing. So, it looks like a window instead of a mirror, kind of. Yes, exactly. There used to be a window on that wall. My dad told me that once. But someone built the wall over it before he moved in. He's moving his mouth like he's trying to talk. What's he saying? can't tell. I can't hear anything at all. Like th three words maybe. Get closer. Maybe you can hear him. 
No way. My hand doesn't leave the light switch. Okay. Okay. Can you try and take a picture of him? Yes. Hold on. Okay. Send. Uh... Tessa? I mean, it's pretty dark, but... I just see you in the mirror. No one else. And you look scared as hell. He's there. He's definitely there. He just put his hand against the mirror. Like he's trying to get in. Whatever it is, it isn't real. He's pounding on the glass with his fists. But it doesn't make any noise when he hits it. He's shouting now, but I can't hear anything. It's definitely, it's definitely snowing behind him. He looks so cold. Maybe you should turn the light on. Maybe this wasn't a good idea. He just took out the knife. And sliced his hand open with it. He's writing something on the mirror in blood. What does it say? It says, Let me in. Tessa, seriously, turn on the light. Wait. Maybe he'll write something else. Maybe I can find out more. We don't need to know anymore. You really didn't look good in that pick test. Maybe you're sick or something. Wait. He's backing away. I can barely see anything now. He kind of disappeared. Just darkness and snow falling. Maybe it's over. Good. No, wait. He's running towards me. I think he's gonna try to break the glass. Turn on the damn light! I did. The mirror just exploded out of frame. Broke into a million pieces. What? Really? Did you turn the light on? I tried, but... The bulb burned out when I touched the switch. It's so dark in here. You need to get out of there. stuff floating in the air. What kind of stuff? I think... I think it's snow. Yes. There's snowflakes. 
and just landed on my arm. It's cold. The whole room feels cold. Tessa, please just come over to my house. Okay, I will. I'll come right now. The door to my bedroom won't open. It's stuck. Is that normal? It doesn't even have a lock on it. Why won't it open? Try to break it down or something. I'm trying. I'm kicking and pounding on it. But it won't move. Okay, don't panic. I'll get my brother. I'll come over and get you out of there. My hands are getting numb. It's really freezing in here. The room feels so strange, Megs. Strange how? Like someone's in here with me. Like he's in here. Do you see him? But there's wet blood on the broken mirror pieces. His blood. It could be your blood. Maybe you cut yourself on the glass. Megs. Hurry. I can hear something now. It sounds like... Someone breathing. It sounds... So close. And that's the end of the story. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, if you guys did, don't forget to give this video a big old thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, as we are still making our way slowly to that 1,000 subscriber mark. And if you guys have any suggestions for stories that you would like me to read, please leave them in the comment section below. And as always, I will see all you dudes and ladies in the next video. Bye-bye.